Hey there, Wargamers, Justin, our Patreon. Today, we're going to check out some salvage boxes. I'd like to welcome you guys back to the channel. If you're new here, please alpha strike that like and subscribe button. If you're a returning viewer, thank you for tuning in to help support what I do. I really appreciate that. That said, today we're going to be checking out some salvage boxes I got from the most recent Battletech Mercenaries Kickstarter from Callus Games Labs. And I have got, we've got three, six, I threw them down because I thought it would be funny and now I'm sitting here on camera collecting them. That's nine, 12, 15 salvage boxes to unbox here on the channel and give you guys a preview of what we've got today. Now, I didn't open these when I first got them from the Kickstarter, and I know there's a chance that uh, some of these might have vehicles in them when they're not supposed to. So if we see that, you'll see me read maybe a little bit um, and then uh, get a message out to uh, Quartermaster to let them know that uh, they screwed up. So hopefully it doesn't happen. But in either case, let's flip it around and we'll open up some blind boxes in the form of salvage boxes today. All right, guys. So we have got all these salvage boxes out on the desk here, and we will be able to pop them open and check out the contents, see what we've got. Uh, give us a reasonable idea of the spread of mechs that we get um, and uh, how they, they kind of work out. So we will move these over to this side next to me, get a little zoom in, and we will start popping open boxes so you guys can see. Uh, this is going to be kind of like opening Pokemon cards. We just want to see what we get. Um, and because these are just things that are from the Kickstarter anyway, it's probably not like we're going to get anything super rare, but we'll get some stuff. So we'll see what we got here. All right, so we have got ourselves a little little scorpion, which we have done. Um, there'll be an unboxing review of this as well. So you guys will see that, and we will get the card and the pilot, which already exists. Um, there's nothing new about this box um, with pilots. Would have been cool, but nothing new. So that's our first guy. Okay, pop open the second one. And as I'm doing this, you know, I'm just curious, like extras I'm getting and whatnot. But like for anyone who's watching that has hopefully got your Kickstarter, if you haven't, hopefully you get it soon. What have you guys been getting? What? How did your salvage box pulls go? So I got an Ost Scout here. Okay. So I was just really excited to get some extra stuff. I opted for all mechs instead of vehicles because uh, on the Kickstarter, I think if you got a vehicle salvage box, like I think you had to pay extra or something for it. Um, and I wasn't trying to do that. Okay, so we got our first duplicate here, unfortunately. So we've got two spiders, or scorpions rather. Okay. Sounds like something very light. And um, so I got uh, got a vehicle here. I'm, I'm one of the people who got a vehicle in their salvage box. Um, so that wasn't supposed to happen. So got one of those. So it's a big boy. So a grizzly. Okay, I should have known when I shook the other one that I was going to be in the vehicle because I could tell it was super light. And if I'd gotten hit with it, here's another duplicate. My goodness. Um, I figured I'd get hit with at least one. Hopefully not more than one. We'll see. Hey, okay, so Locust 2C here, not uh, not displeased about that one. Okay, got the Shadowhawk 2C, okay. And a third scorpion. Okay. It's a, a little bit disheartening with the number of duplicates here. Um, a little bit. Okay. 
Yep, and I got a second vehicle, so got hit with that twice. That's cool. It was the Galleon, same one. Okay, so we've got a Hermes. And I know that uh, as of filming this, there's probably people in the comments that are um, raging, you know, and I'm voicing some concern about duplicates and the vehicles and, well, at least you got your Kickstarter. That That is a fair point, but also um, I was kind of hoping there'd be a better spread, and also this was a thing that they already admitted to screwing up. So there's that. Okay, so we got ourselves a charger. That's cool. So that's a different one. is the Clint. All right, so we're uh, if we make it through these last two and they aren't duplicates, I'll feel a little bit better. Um, but I can almost guarantee this is another vehicle. Almost guarantee that's what that is. Okay, so we got a Dervish. Another galleon. So I uh, got hit with that three three times. Uh, if that was just one, I probably wouldn't email, but I think we are going to email at this point because um, that's incorrect. So um, yeah. So out of our salvage boxes, I had three scorpions, two of this big guy um, grizzlies. Um, and three of the Galleon uh, Miss Packs. Um, so a little bit frustrated about that because that would be, that is eight. That's about half of my salvage boxes. So we had three, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Over half, um, right? Do math. Yeah, over half were um, in some form of a duplicate and um, three of them being uh, the, the vehicle. So that's a little bit frustrating. Um, so we'll send an email to uh, Quartermaster and uh, see if they can fix it. But that said, that was my spread on the salvage boxes. Um, I wonder if things just weren't sorted as well. And, you know, they I thought they had already caught this already, and I guess they did not. So email will go. Let me know how your salvage boxes went in the comments below. And there you have it, folks. You still see these pile of boxes here because I filmed the intro and outro at the same time. And I have no idea what the heck was in these, but I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you are a viewer who is still waiting on the Kickstarter, please be patient. I hope that that arrives soon. And if you've already got yours, uh, that's awesome as well. In either case, regardless of which side of that line you fall on, if you guys have any thoughts, concerns, critiques, anything at all about the channel, Battletech, the Kickstarter, these salvage boxes, anything at all, let's get that conversation started below. If you've already got your Kickstarter stuff, let me know what uh, how you felt your spreads were for these salvage boxes if you got hit with the uh, vehicle blunder um, and so forth. I think that'd be interesting. I know I've seen some online and I feel like I've seen the vehicle blunder and then the spread on the salvage boxes didn't feel good. One of the guys I talked to on um, Facebook showed me what he got and he had like, I think a row of seven mechs, all singles, and then one row had like five of the same guy. And I was like, that seems like your spread wasn't that great. Uh, so I'd be curious what everyone's experience is. Uh, did they not shuffle these up as well? So let me know in the comments below. On that note, though, folks, I've got nothing left for you today. As always, if you want to support the channel, check the description down below. All the relevant links to help fuel the channel, keep videos and content coming can be found there, and your continued support is much appreciated. That said, it's time for me to go, though. As always, folks, keep rolling your dice, keep painting those models, and I will catch you guys next time. If you made it this far, you're probably a viewer that already hits that like button when you see a video come up. You're probably already a subscriber and you probably jump into the comments down below to help support the channel, to help support that algorithm. But if you're looking for some other ways to help support the channel too, make sure you check the description down below. Maybe you want to pick up some paints from Monument Hobbies. That's my paint of choice. The Pro Acrylic line is 
Chef's Kiss, good stuff. Maybe you want to check out some of the offerings from Death Designs where I work in my day job. We got plenty of 3D printed uh, products as well as MDF terrain, some of the stuff that I have designed myself and we play with here on the channel. And if you're looking to bolster your Battletech uh, ranks, miniatures, and offerings, make sure you check out uh, Bobby from Fortress Miniatures and Games. He's one of the main supporters of the channel as well, and supporting any of these companies helps support what I do and helps to ensure that I can continue to bring content to all of you. If you want to become a super supporter, I highly recommend you guys check out the Patreon. You guys get the extra little edge to help push more content out, and I really do appreciate that. And my ultimate goal on the channel is to continue to be able to not, put, not only put out the content we have now, but to get to a point where you can put out more content later, whether that be battle reports or painting tutorials or just more rambles, anything at all. I'd like to be doing more content for you. This is something that I enjoy. I like being able to cast a light into the darkness to bring a little bit of hobby positivity to all of you and make you feel good and also enjoy playing games myself. As we do the final sign off here though, I do wanna go ahead and switch on over and do the, the scroll of awesome to showcase all the Patreon supporters, the super supporters of the channel to give them some recognition for helping support what I do. Thank you guys so much and I'll catch you guys next time.